everybody. Sorry I've been away for, well, not that long, but, you know. Anyway, I had a very hectic Christmas. Lots of people at my house, far too much noise to make my videos, far too much work to do, so. Back at uni now, I can make a video. I'm talking to this one just so that I can, well, explain that, and also explain, unfortunately, about my nails. I started using a new hand cream and it basically caused two of my nails to get far too soft and they ripped and then a couple of others just started tearing so <laughs> I've had to cut them all short but in about three weeks they should be back to their stay growing incredibly quickly <laughs> I hope you guys don't mind my voice it's also slightly quirky because I've had a um, cold mm, Christmas, which is wonderful, as you can imagine. <laughs> um, so I thought I would today show you just a few things that well, I got for Christmas, really, um, and see how you guys like it. So I've got this first one. Well, You may have noticed that I have yet to get a new webcam or microphone. They are coming, I promise. Um, but it won't be till the end of January because I have exams um, for a few weeks. So I don't really have time to try and shop around for a nice one. And I'll also be getting a cheap microphone because I want to save up for a really nice one. But obviously you guys can hear my laptop fan at the moment. Um, so it's just one that's away from the laptop. Anyway, this is a lovely little jewellery box that my dad got me from Singapore. He's working out there for a bit with his company. So on his last trip he brought me my sister. It's a cute little jewellery boxes or trinket boxes. I think hers had a swan on it, but I'm not sure. I can't remember. Also, if you guys could let me know in the comments if my voice is alright. <laughs> Basically, if you think I can do whisper videos or no talking videos, if, that's, if you guys would like that, then I perfectly happy to. I just didn't think that my voice was particularly great. <laughs> so yes, I will talk through this one and tell me if it's terrible and I will refilm it all <laughs> in silence. So I'll keep it up. I'll refilm it. Nice little mirror inside. And it's got like, I would say it's velvet. I'm not sure if it's actually velvet or. Is there a material that feels like velvet that's not velvet? I'm not sure. Yeah. Suede? No. I'm not sure. Either way, it's lined with red velvet. I haven't got any see why <laughs> in probably the next item you'll see why I'm doing that video and it makes a nice noise when you close the lid as well so it's got this be able to hear the uh, rain outside. I'm very sorry. It's going to be stormy where I am. Anyway, it's got this raised bit. Just the one, just this one little sort of S-shaped bit. The rest of it's just flat but it's painted on. It's very pretty. 
Yes, please excuse the shortness of my nails. I'm very upset. <laughs> I don't think my nails have actually ripped in about ten or so years. They tend to just get really long. I get annoyed and cut them short again. So yes, right, that's that done. Right, I'll show you why I don't have any jewellery or anything in that box. And that is because I got this hefty thing for Christmas from my grandmother. And it is a jewellery box. It's called, I've left this on for you guys so that I can do this. It's the plastic bit that peels off. Are you ready? Don't worry. Let's bit. No, it's not. Okay. So this is, it's pleather. It's not real. I didn't really want real leather to be honest. <laughs> it absorbs far too many smells. Whatever, anyway. It's got a nice sort of crocodile skin pattern. Not actual crocodile skin, but for any of you. Um, <laughs> sorry, I have a hot water bottle and it just fell on the floor. I hope that wasn't too loud. I have no editing software. comments say that that happens so you can skip over anyway. So it opens by this little latch and then it opens again like that and then it opens again <laughs> you slide out and there's uh, these don't actually come out of the book, they go about that high. And they've got these little latches that you can... And it rests. Um, they're necklace holders, so if I can find my finger on the camera, these open up and you can then store the necklace in this so that they don't get tangled, which is wonderful because that's quite a big problem that I have with some of my necklaces. <laughs> I'll show you as well. Because it's my birthday is in the middle of exams, so my grandmother also gave me my birthday present. Which are the pair. I hope these make nice sounds closer to the microphone. They're beautiful. I think they're quartz earrings, quartz and gold. I think that's where my And this little. Can you guess how old I'm going to be? <laughs> it's got little jewels in it. I've not, I think it's a like a wine glass or a champagne glass decoration that you put on so that you know it's yours. But I'm not sure. She didn't know either. She was just like, have this as well. Chain makes a nice noise. I've got a necklace here that I got out just because getting necklaces. Hang on. Getting necklaces out of this is actually quite loud. <laughs> so I've got this necklace that I thought made a really nice sound. load of leaves. I think it's from Accessorize a few years ago, I don't know. <laughs> it's very old now. Well, not very old, but whatever. Right, next is another, it's another birthday present actually. So, it's 
some of you might already know what this is. Those of you that don't. I don't know if that makes a very nice noise. It doesn't really, does it? Mm. I'm going to take this away from the webcam. There we go. Right. Yes. It's a cross pen. And it's just so that because I'm getting something it's not going to last particularly forever <laughs> for my 21st birthday. My parents wanted me to get something else as well, so they got me what I am to understand is a very expensive pen and it writes wonderfully. And if you guys are interested, I can do a writing video. I can write and I can chat to you, whatever you want. Um, make requests, honestly. I'll <laughs> I need ideas. <laughs> More ideas and stuff to do. So this is my lovely expensive pen. And do you know what I used it for first? Writing out revision. Oh yay. Such fun. I'm going to take this away from the camera to do that again. Yeah, it's not a very nice squeaking cardboard on cardboard noise. And last but not least, Away. Hoping this also doesn't make too much noise. <laughs> I have a biscuit tin. Because you know you get lots of random nibbles for Christmas. I have about a million boxes of chocolates downstairs. <laughs> Which is going to be fuel for a vision. Yeah. Right, so. This has a lovely raised flower and they're red currants on the front. Let's see if I can hold this. There we go. So it's got the flower bits. The flowers. And the red currants. And this bit's plant. And I haven't opened it yet, so it's actually all taped up. I was hoping that that would make a nice sound. So let's... One very long piece of tape. <laughs> okay. Oh no, it's not. It ends right here. Goodness me. Goes around twice apparently. <laughs> So we have, what does it say? Stem ginger and lemon biscuits and double chocolate chip biscuits. Isn't that wonderful? So they're both individually wrapped. I was planning on doing a little bit of eating with these biscuits, but I'll be honest with you, <laughs> I just had a cup of tea and some biscuits downstairs and I'm not really, oh, I don't really fancy it because it's quite late as well. Well, it's not that late to be honest, but yeah, and I think it's going to make far too much noise, but 
once I've got these open at some other point, if people would like, I will do an eating sounds video. Um, I've got biscuits, I have chocolate, I've got um, apples, I can do my dinner, whatever you guys would like. Um, please let me know because, you know, and once I get a new camera, I'm looking at some HD ones, so actual 1080p, not 720, actual 1080p cameras. better and I probably when I get time once I have that camera redo all of my previous videos in higher quality <laughs> if you guys would like because if not I'll just try and find some more stuff to tap on. I hope you guys don't mind that my nails are so short. On. My voice is starting to go <laughs> now. <laughs> My throat's been all good for the past few days. But I thought that one number one I would try and explain and number one why I've been away and why I haven't recorded anything when I said that I would. Um, and I just completely lost my train of thought. <laughs> very wonderful. Okay, one more thing. Oh, bollocks. I might try and download some editing software. <laughs> Anyone got any good recommendations? Because this is <laughs> going slightly. and really have the capacity to run, well, anything. It's basically a word processing machine. So, um, if people can recommend some sort of low um, uh, usage, whatever, um, programs, preferably free, <laughs> I am a low student. I'll delete this video and we upload the edited version. So, one more thing. Just because it's been staring at me and I keep meaning to put it in one of my videos. This is not a Christmas present, I got it last year. It is a chocolate bar keyring and it cracks. I hope that's not too loud. So it's got a bit of metal in the middle, like a hair clip. No, it doesn't always, it isn't actually a hair clip. Uh, bent like a hair clip so that it can bend. And that's sort of, this is sort of the natural state and this is the well, energised, ready to, ready to pop state. Because it very readily goes into this but you have to sort of force it back into this. Um, if you'd like me to do an entire video of just cracking this, then I will do that. Honestly, if you guys have any requests, and when I say requests, I do mean not inappropriate ones, thank you, some of the commenters, <laughs> um, then I'm perfectly willing. Uh, if I have the object to hand, <laughs> uh, then I, yes, I will do a video. Um, now, I won't be able to record um, very long ones for the next couple of weeks because I have exams and I will be hopefully revising very hard. Um, so sorry about that, but then hopefully after that I will have a nice webcam. So I will say goodbye guys. I hope you've had really lovely holidays and I hope you guys are all back at work, back at school. Whatever you're doing now, I hope you have a really happy new year. I will see you soon.